Can you solve for y in this expression 7 to the power of y plus 7 to the power of y plus 7 to the power of y equal to 777? Hello, welcome. Let's solve this together. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel for more simplified mathematics content. Now let's get started. To solve this expression, you will notice that 7 to the power of y appears three times, right? So that can uh, bring out uh, 7 to the power of y because 7 to the power of y seems to be a common term. So that will make 7 to the power of y multiplying 3 because if we add the power of this, this, and this is going to give us 3. And this will be equal to 7, 7, and 7. Cool, right? So what we are going to do from here is to divide both sides by 3. If you divide both sides by 3, you'll find out that this 3 will have to go away with that 3. And then we'll be left with 7y equal to 3 will go here to give us 1. 3 in 7 is going to give us 2, right? Remember 1. Uh, 17 divided by 3 is going to give us 5, right? Remember 2. And then 27 divided by 3 is going to simply give us uh, 9. So we're going to have 7 to the power of y equal to 2, 5, 9. And 7 to the power of 9 can be equal to 2, 5, 9. Now, if we break this into factor, this can give us 37 multiplied by 7, right? So we can replace that with 37 multiplied by 7. So we'll have a 7 to the power of y equal to 7 multiplied by 37. Now, how do we simplify this? Because there is no way we can make this to become a power of 7. Because there is nothing we can multiply this that will give us 37. So, the best route to solve this question is using log. Because this is not going to work. We we'll look for a base for this. Now, what we're going to do is to take the log or the natural log of both sides. So, we're going to take the log of... Uh, y base 7 equal to the log of 7 multiplied by 37. Great. So having seen this, we'll, all we need to do is uh, to use the laws of logarithm. You recall this law, the log of a to the power of y will give us y multiplied by the log of a and also we have uh, the log of a multiplied by b. If you have this, this can be equal to the log of a plus the log of b. Cool. Now let's look at that. If we apply that to that expression, we're going to have that expression to now become y log of 7 equal to the log of 7 plus the log of 37. Great. Now, having seen this, to get the value of y, we're going to divide through by the log of 7. So if we divide through by the log of 7, we're going to have the value of y. So from this, 7 we simply clear 7. Over here, 7 we clear 7. So we'll be left with y equal to, and that will give us 1 plus the log of 37 divided by the log of, sorry, this is going to be log of 7. And that will be the log of 7. So that value of y will be equal to 
Now recall one law of logarithm that if you have the log of A dividing the log of B, this can be equal to the log of A base B because the denominator is going to become the base. So if we apply that to that expression, the value of our y will now be equal to 1 plus our expression will now become the log of 37 base 7. So this will become the solution to that question that is given to us from the beginning of this law of this uh, solution. So the solution to that expression is y equal to 1 plus the log of 37 base 7. If you did find this solution useful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, share it with friends and colleagues, and remember to subscribe to my channel for more simplified mathematics solutions. Thanks so much for watching and bye-bye for now.